Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a day in the lifestyle video and I'm just going to take you guys along with us throughout the day. We have some school supply shopping to do and a few other things so I hope you enjoy this video and if you're new make sure that you subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. Alright let's go ahead and just jump right into this video. Right after we ate breakfast I went ahead and started on some of my Etsy orders. I do a lot of vinyl and heat press shirts and then I also do some everyday screen printed shirts as well so I'll leave a link for my shop below because I do get questions about this all the time but after I make all of my shirts then I have to weigh them so that I can put in the weight for shipping and then I will print all of my shipping labels using my demo printer and then I'll bag them up and ship them out. Y'all let me know down in the comments below if you guys would be interested in seeing anything about Etsy, starting a shop, or vinyl tees, or screen printed tees because I'd love to share with you guys if you would like. Alright, so we just got in the car and we're getting ready to go to Target and look for some school supplies. We have, I have their list and everything is ready. I'm pulling out of the driveway right now, but it is rainy and nasty outside. So, it's kind of a gross day to be getting out, but, you know, sometimes you got to do what you got to do. But I'm going to put these in our mailbox really quick, and then we're going to head out. Yeah, so my hair is not going to last very long because it is nasty outside. But, anyways, we're going to go to Target now. And that meat and us at chick fil <laughs> Jason's already eating his food. He's got his ice cream cone. Ooh, ice cream. And of course I had a spicy sandwich. So good, Emma. Diet Dr. Pepper. Alright, so we just got to Target. About to run in. Um, I'm about to take my little Tylenol. I've got a headache. <laughs> you are so weird. She loves the camera, y'all. So we're gonna run in, get some school supplies, and Gracie Jim, what do you want to get? Um, two well and she has a little gift card to spend from her birthday, so she wants and, to get an LOL doll. She and, wants two, so we'll see if they have any. Two LOL pets. And LOL pets. We'll see if you have enough money for that. <laughs> All right. All right, so I'm gonna show you some of the school supplies, and they did have really good deals at Target, but honestly, I think next year, I'm going to go a few weeks earlier for shopping, and I'm also gonna to go to Walmart, just because they had a much bigger selection, especially when it came to like lunch boxes and water bottles and all of that. So next year, I will be going to Walmart instead of Target. Let's make it last forever, I'm ready to fly. Before we collide And when the sun don't shine on you Just heat it up Before we collide Make a run together, I'll be by your side Before we collide And if the sky falls down on you Just feed it up and here you can see how picked over the lunchbox section was. They really hardly had anything, especially for boys that were my son's age. So he's going into second grade and I felt like a lot of lunch boxes were more for like little kids. And um, there was plenty of girl stuff left, but still I feel like the selection was very small. And then 
I loved this marble dry erase board and then they also had a weekly planner dry erase board. I could definitely use these in my office but I was budgeting so I'm not and then the teacher and me loved the colors on those baskets. All right, we just got back home and I'm gonna kind of show you guys all the school supplies that we got. Um, this is all Gracie June's set right here and she got this Moana lunch box. We got some Expo markers, two packs of crayons. We got two packs of glue sticks and I just got the Target brand for that one. Pink erasers, she picked out a little pink pencil box. Um, this is a primary journal, so it's like got the part at the top where you can draw and then right on the bottom. Then she picked out some pink scissors, some Crayola colored pencils, markers, and then two packs of these pencils. These are, um, this brand right here is the best pencil brand which they asked for these but I think I'm gonna also get some sharpened pencils too because I know as a teacher I always liked having sharpened pencils sent in. Alright and then this is Kaysen's pile and he's going into second grade. Gracie June's going into kindergarten and he picked out this Pokemon lunchbox. I was not crazy about it and he really doesn't even watch Pokemon or play with any of that stuff anymore so I don't know why he got that but there really was not much um, variety so I kind of wish we would have gone to Walmart instead but we got two packs of crayons for him. He needed some wide ruled paper. He picked out the green scissors. Two packs of pencils as well. Same dry erase markers for him. I did get him a little black pencil sharpener, some erasers. He had to have some regular glue, liquid glue, and then we have two packs of glue sticks. We already had these glue sticks, so I just threw those in there. And then he has to have a pencil bag, three composition books that are wide ruled, and then a one inch binder, and I just went with the Target brand on that one. And then I'm gonna show you his clothes. I didn't end up getting Gracie June anything because they really did not have much. So I'm gonna have to get her some dresses somewhere else. But I got him three pairs of shorts. I got him just a navy blue pair, a regular khaki, and then like a gray colored. And then I got him a few shirts. He does have a lot of shirts right now, but um, I did get him a couple of new ones. The gray and the red are just plain. And then I let him pick out one shirt and of course he picks out this Minecraft shirt and then I got him this pink shirt with the little navy blue pocket which was super cute. So after we got home we ended up opening Gracie June's toys. She found two LOL pets but they didn't have any of the dolls so she got to get two of these and we're opening them now. She ended up with two kitty cats and then Kaysen got some new Roblox characters for his collection and he's trying to show you here. But we just sat and played with them for a while in the little LOL pets. It comes with like a pooper scooper thing and some kinetic sand. So they sat and played with that for a while. So I ended up having to clean up the mess with the vacuum when we were done. Tell us about them. What do they do? Pee and crier. Oh my goodness. That's so silly. <laughs> you know. You know. I never have a pee and a crier before. Yeah. You like those LOL pets? Yeah. Are they cool? Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. I never see these before. I never saw those either. They're cute. Do you get two kitty cats? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. All right, so the kids are playing. You'll probably hear Gracie June in a minute because she's over here playing with her new LOL pets and little ponies and all kinds of stuff. And Kaysen's playing on the computer, so I'm about to get dinner ready. We are going to church tonight. We always go on Wednesday nights unless Chance for some reason gets home late. 
and we I plan on doing the meatballs in the crock pot and I was doing sriracha meatballs but I'm gonna just cook them on the stove because we're running out of time and I forgot to start those before we left plus those are already like cooked all the way through so they just need to be reheated um, they're frozen but they're cooked fully cooked and they just need to be reheated so if I had put them in the crock pot it would have only taken a few hours and I just thought that we would be home earlier than we are. It is 4.45 right now, and we go to church. Our church starts at 6.45, so I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking, and I'll just kinda show you guys what we're doing since I have changed it from crock pot to stove top. All right, so we just had these leftover meatballs from um, Walmart, and they're the Great Value brand. And then you're gonna need soy sauce, sesame oil, honey, sriracha sauce, and minced garlic. So the first thing I'm gonna do is make my sauce and I'm using three tablespoons of minced garlic. And then you're gonna use about a tablespoon of sriracha, you can add more if you want, and then three tablespoons of honey. about a tablespoon of sesame oil, and then three tablespoons of soy sauce. For the meatballs, I sprayed the pan and then stuck them in on low heat and let them just simmer until they were heated all the way through. And with this dish, I'm making rice, and I use one and three fourths cups of water for one cup of rice, and then I let it cook for 18 minutes, and it just simmers on low. When the meatballs were done, I went ahead and put some on the kids' plates before I put the sauce on them because they will probably complain that it's a little too spicy, so they eat their meatballs plain with ketchup. And then I just put the sauce on top of the meatballs and let it simmer for a few more minutes and just so that the sauce could get hot. For the kids, I just put their rice on the side, but for Chance and I, I ended up doing a bowl and putting the rice on the bottom and then the meatballs on the top. And you'll see while we were eating dinner, I ended up adding more soy sauce and sriracha to mine just to make it a little bit more saucy, but you can eat it however you want. And then Chance got home just in time for dinner and to help Gracie June clean up all of her Shopkins so we could set the table. This recipe was super easy and delicious, and I think next time we're gonna even try to cook it with some teriyaki sauce as well. Y'all let me know down in the comments below if you have any good meatball recipes that you like to eat with your family. After dinner, I went ahead and started cleaning up. These are all of our school supplies. I had to move them into the other room, and then drinks and things that we had gotten. And of course, Casey's gonna dance in front of the camera. But we had to hurry up and do a really fast cleaning of the kitchen before we had to leave to go to church. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see the world in action. What we can be. Life with no distractions. We'll get away. This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow We can't miss out I'm done living life with the lights out Die with my own doubts Be free with me Let's go Free. Free. 
missed my last cook and clean with me, you need to go watch it because it's hilarious. Chance ended up taking over for me because I cut my finger on a knife and I was using that bubble up brush, which it's super rough. And as you can see, I'm no longer using it. I think I'm gonna use it maybe for cleaning somewhere else in the house. I'm not really sure yet, but I went back to my mint brush and I do need to get a new one. This one was from TJ Maxx. So I do plan on going to get a new brush soon. Chance wasn't lying when he said in my last video that Kaysen flips his water bottles on our countertops all the time. Y'all let me know if your kids are doing it too. cleaning done as we could before we had to leave. Church starts at 645. So Gracie June's talking about something bad there. <laughs> but we're gonna go to church and then come back home and hang out. Oh chance, what do you think of the sriracha meatballs? They're delicious. I'm getting, I'm getting them out of my teeth. Yeah. And I want to eat them. We said next time we would probably add some like teriyaki sauce we think that would make it a little bit better um but they were still really good all right guys so we are back home and um we just got done putting the kids to bed i washed my face i need to go get my pajamas chance is actually still upstairs putting gracie june to bed um, but we're just going to call it a night. I hope you guys had fun hanging out with us today and enjoyed this day in our lives. If you did, make sure that you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new and hit that notification bell and it will tell you anytime I have a new video up. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! I